And now let's head down to the coin toss. It is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. Both teams have sent their special teams onto the field, and we're ready for the opening kickoff. He just drills this one. Makes it out to maybe the 19-yard line. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. Second and four coming up here. Ball on their own 26. He gets to about the 34-yard line. You talk about a dual-threat guy, this guy can hurt you in the air or on the ground. Gains about four yards on the play. That makes it seven and six. Second and six. Ball on their own 38. Strip that ball. 51, Mike. Mike, 51. Ball is loose. Fumble. It's scooped up. Drop down around the 41 yard line. So the offense will come out for their first possession. Good field position for their first possession of the ball game. Let's see if they can capitalize off of it. He's out of bounds at the 36. From the 36-yard line, second down. positive yardage. Nice run there by the tailback, and it's good for the first. And that shows you why he's such a weapon as a ball carrier. Good game for the offense. On the ground, left side. Tackled outside after a nice pickup. It's second and six. Ball on the 26-yard line. The defense might need to make some changes to their coverage scheme because that was just too easy. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. pressure on that play. Well, let's see what they do here. It's third and goal from the six. And he's tackled right away. Back to the line, maybe a yard on the pass. Doesn't look like this defense is going to let them beat him with the deep passes. So they'll allow those short completions to the tight end. Miami could take the lead with this field goal. 
The kick is up, and it's Quincy uprights. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Hurricanes are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. The last time the offense had it, they lost a fumble. So I'm pretty sure the coaching staff was over there talking about ball security. You don't change your philosophy after one play. They'll be out doing the same thing as before, just with better awareness. Makes it to the 34. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. And they keep it on the ground for the first down. Nothing too fancy here. The key is that the running back was able to convert the first down. I like how the defense got all up into that option to disrupt it. The offense looks a bit unsettled after losing that battle. From their own 32-yard line. Second down. Here's the halfback, and he's brought down hard behind the line. is waiting for the snap. He drops it. Well, that's exactly what happens when you take your eyes off the ball. Concentration for return man is of the utmost importance. And in a tight game like this one, it's a mistake like that one that could really be the turning point in the game. The defense was able to keep them out of the end zone on their last possession, but the offense did pick up three. Tackle made at the 24. That's a team of one on the way. That makes it second and eight. From their own 24-yard line. It's second down. Miami is up a field goal. Throws a laser across the middle. He's into the open field. The 10. And he's all the way in for the touchdown. What a strike for the score. And he did a nice job of looking off his defenders. the extra point. A short two-play, 78-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. Boy, that is scoring in a hurry. This offense looking more and more explosive. So the score now, 10-0. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. He makes it out to maybe the 20-yard line. Miami's defense is playing lights out right now. Pitching a shot. Yeah, I would not be shocked at all to see this defense be able to maintain this. I, I just the way they're playing, the attitude that they seem to be playing with, if they can maintain the energy and the awareness of this offense, there's a very good shot that they can shut this offense out. And he's taken down at the 18. You know, a lot of times coaches look to linebackers for leadership on defense. And on that tackle, he showed you why that's the case.
from their own 18-yard line. Second down. They'll knock him down for a loss. The quarterback tried to do a little too much by himself. Hey, maybe next time he'll get it out to the back so he can do something with it. Gets it out in a hurry. Incomplete pass. That'll make it fourth down, and they're going to have to punt. It was a good hold by the defense on third down. Now their punt returner will get a chance to make something happen. Carroll to punt. Brought down at the 46-yard line. They punched it in for six on the last series. Can they do it again? This offensive coordinator has got to be feeling so good about the execution that he's seeing from this quarterback and his wide receivers. Because, again, they put so much time in trying to put a plan together. And to be able to see that actually come into play makes you feel pretty good as a play call. Gain of two on the play. That makes it second and eight. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 44. the 45. More plays like this and the coaching staff is going to need to change up the blocking schemes. You can't allow the defense to play in your backfield. And they make the stop at about the 41. They call on the kicker for a long field goal. Kicks away. That's a tough break there for the kicker. So our count is still 10-0 Miami. You know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away. They've been beaten soundly on both sides of the ball, and we haven't even gotten to the second quarter. And they get nice yardage on that run. Second and five. Ball on the 46-yard line. the ball for a nice game. That'll bring an end to the first quarter of action. 10-0, Hurricane. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. Around the 46-yard line. That's a first down, Brad. And I'll tell you, this running back has shown a nose to be able to pick up some first downs. Just a hard-nosed, tough, physical back. That when they know they need those short yards to pick up the first down, he's the guy they can turn to. Nice run there. The fullback showing some good skills there on the option. He got five. That brings him second down. It's second down, five to go. Ball on the 41-yard line. He's taken down at the 32-yard line. That makes it first and ten. Mike, fifty-one. Mike, fifty-one. Check And he's tackled around the 30-yard line. Russell gets the option for about a two or three yard gain. From the 30 yard line, it's second down. Here's the pitch, and now he's got the corner. He's at the 20. He's tackled around the 15-yard line. Great job here converting and keeping this defense on the field. They're getting very tired.
from the 15 yard line. First down. They'll bring him down at the 17. That play was over before it got started. That was just a case of the offensive line getting beat at the snap of the ball. We're at play number nine of this current drive. So we're looking at another third down here. He might have a chance. Caught by the sophomore. Nice play to set up first and goal. I think the quarterback there really sensed the pressure was coming. He did a nice job of being able to avoid the pressure, still keep his focus and vision downfield, and made the good throw for the first down. They're crowding the line. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. You've got to admire the intensity that these linebackers bring to the table. As soon as he saw it was staying on the ground, he made a beeline for the ball carrier. They're at the three. Second down. Brought down just outside the goal line. This is the 13th play of this drive. And the goal line defense digging in here. Touchdown, Sooners. Here's the point after to try to cut this to a three-point game. And he tacks on the extra point. It was a 13-play, 60-yard drive, and they put up seven points. Boy, this offense right now is just being physical, really controlling the line of scrimmage, and it's opening up some nice big lanes for the running back. He's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 28. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Miami has a three-point lead. Makes it out to about the 36. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. it to the 38-yard line. He gets out to about the 38-yard line. It's first and ten. Ball on the 38. it out to about the 41 yard line a couple maybe three yards on that run Receiver was able to go up and make the play. First and ten. 
Ball in the 32. Miami is up by three. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. He goes out of bounds at the 26-yard line. And this is the eighth play of the drive. He's on the run. Inside the 10. Touchdown, Hurricanes. He makes the PAT. like they're ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. They'll bring him down at the 33. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead, and on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. It out. And he stopped behind the line. A one-yard loss. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. We got a second and 11. Ball on the 32. He's hit and taken down. Slings it. Keep those chains moving. Just a simple out route that time, and it was enough to beat the zone defense. to tuck it in he's got space and he tackles him hard at the 44 yard line first down 10 yards to go ball on the 44 yard line lets it fly this one is dropped six yards on the scramble. They're about four yards away here on third down. Well, as they take a look at that injury on the sideline, let's see what this backup can do at quarterback. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. He's scrambling, and he's going to be sacked. Man, these guys can be aggressive. When you stand back there and take hits like that, you definitely are going to feel it the next day. And down he goes at the 22-yard line. And they make the stop at about the 17-yard line. Looks like someone got a head start on the line. That penalty will move them back a bit. Yeah, and with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. So we'll have first and 15 after the penalty. The Sooners quarterback went down with that injury earlier. The bad news is it sounds like he's not going to be able to get back in this game. 
He heaves it to the end zone. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. 13th play of the drive coming up. The kick is up, and he got it. Oklahoma, the kick. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They ran the ball very well on their last drive, and it resulted in six. Miami is up by a touchdown. And he's level at the 27. A tight first half of football, and we head to the break. 17-10, Miami. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. This game's been everything we anticipated it being. Each team matching each other blow for blow. Just a one possession game at this point. What do you expect to change things in the second half? Well, it's always it's always fun to watch two teams and two games match up the hype. And we, we talk about it all week and how big this game is. And it's going to come down to players making plays. And, you know, the, the big play is something that we continue to beat into the ground. And which one doesn't give that up? A lot of times, you know, games are lost and won by turnovers and, and giving it away and making that crucial mistake. You can do everything right and you can execute right. But it just takes that one misstep, that one turnover to, to really put you in a bad position or a bad situation that can determine this game. That's what it looks like it's going to. Both teams executing well. Who's going to make a big mistake? That'll do it here in the studio at halftime. We'll try to see if Pollock can bring a little energy in the second half. Got a lot of games to watch, including yours. Brad and Kirk ready for the second half. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So they're just about set to get the game going again. It's, it's gonna be a long the offense going to try to open this field up, coming out in a five-wide set. And the defense counters with their dime look. Tackle to 37-yard line. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 37-yard line. Miami is up a score. They go to the left for a nice game. That makes it second and six. I got one. I got one. Ready. He's hit immediately. Let's give this quarterback a lot of credit. He recognized the man coverage. And guys, I'm going to tell you something. He probably knew he was going to go to the post before the ball was even snapped. Well done. From the 39-yard line, it's first down. They need to get it to the 29. Ready? 33 is the mic. Here we go. Pressure coming. Quick throw, incomplete. One of his receiver. Johnson's intended receiver play. Fourth down. Miami is hoping to make this a two score game. 
It's up. And it's off the crossbar. No good. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Oklahoma! Up the middle for a nice game. Second and five, ball on the 44. And they push him out at the 45. Tackled after a decent pickup. From the 41 yard line, it's second down. Just gets rid of it. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. Scrambling around. Ball is loose. Fumble. They fall out. doesn't want to touch back here. He wants to knock this ball inside the 10. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. Both sides have made their way back out, and we're just about set to get going again. Miami up seven points. From their own 18-yard line, it's second down. Open receiver, no good. Defensive coordinator anticipating this five-wide set, and he comes in with his dime packing. He throws right. Well, the quarterback's breathing a huge sigh of relief because he got away with throwing what should have been an interception. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. He's at midfield. He breaks it. He makes it out to maybe the 46-yard line. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. They'll bring him down at about the 35. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 35. And he's tackled at the 18-yard line. The option's one of the more difficult plays to defend. The defense went after the quarterback, which left the running back with plenty of room. Roger, Roger. 51, Mike. Mike, 51. He's going to 
to try and scramble. He gets sacked on the play. Second and 11 coming up now. Ball on the 20 yard line. And they hit him in the backfield. The halfback took the pitch but couldn't find any running lane. And there were no running lanes because this defense had so much penetration into the backfield. We would have been lucky to get back to the line of scrimmage. It's fourth down. They'll line it up for the field goal. Kicks away, and he's got it. Oklahoma ready to kick this one off. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Miami's offense was rolling along earlier, and now they have gone ice cold in the third quarter. Brad, they almost look like a different team. It's like they've come out of the locker room a little bit flat here in the second half. We'll see if they can have something happen, something to spark them and maybe get their mojo going before they end up losing this ball game. Miami holds a four-point lead. Nice run there. Second, and six. Second down and six. Ball on the 29-yard line. Just throws this one away. That's a big gain and more than enough for the first down. From their own 48-yard line, first down. Three down, three down. 41's coming, 41 the mic. Sam, black with the five. Black with the five. Throwing left. And he got it! He's tackled at the 15. Play. We've got a first down. Here's the throw. I don't think he got anything on that. And he didn't have much of a chance on that play. Boy, this defense has a lot of speed. They're all over him by the time he caught the ball. Miami is up four. Brought down right around the 12 yard line. That makes it 37. And so it's another third down upcoming here. play of this drive. He steps out at the one-yard line. Now here's the line. 
from the one yard line. Second down. They'll knock him down for a loss. You keep gaining negative yards, and you put yourself in a position of having to make bigger and bigger plays. Puts a lot of pressure on that quarterback. This is the 10th play of this drive. Roger, Roger! Here we go, deep, all day, defense, all day! All day. Run, run, run. Touchdown, Kane! the PAT. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20. Across the 30. Tackle made at the 41-yard line. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He's at midfield, and he's taken down around the 47-yard line. So at the end of three, Miami in front, 24-13. We're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Mike, 51. Roger, Roger. Check 82. Watch 82. Ball coming. He's at the 30. He's knocked out of bounds at the 23. First and 10. Ball in the 23. He laterals the ball. And the option to the halfback gets six yards. Second down. Pitches it. He's got the corner. And he carries the ball for a nice game. And this play is number eight on the drive. Looks like they're going to go for it on fourth down. Mike 51, Mike 51. And he's level at the 14. It's always a gamble going for it with so many yards to come up with. But when you're behind, sometimes you have to take risks to get back into a ball game.
Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Wants to throw outside. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. Smart, heady play by that defender. That was solid, fundamental pass defense. They line up at the 14. Second down. Short pass, middle of the field. Tackle made around the 24-yard line. Going to run it, and he's got room to work. He's taken down around the 29-yard line. From their own 29-yard line, it's second down. Run, run, run. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. so wide open as a quarterback you just don't want to blow that's like having a wide open layup with nobody behind you and you go up and you miss a layup you don't want that to happen to you as a quarterback so the quarterback did a nice job of staying in rhythm making the easy throw and the touchdown for this wide receiver Miami gets set to kick this one away and it goes into the end zone down for a touchback They're ready to begin another drive. Roger, Roger. Oh, Mike, Mike 51, Mike 51. Mike, oh, Mike. With the pass incomplete. He'll learn he doesn't always need to use his cannon. Sometimes precision is more important than power. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. They've decided to go for it here. And he hits him hard at the 43. That's a deep on the play. First down. Watch the pass. Mike 51. Mike 51. He's scrambling, and he can't get away from the pressure. So that sack sets him back a little bit now. They're looking at second and 13. Less than three minutes in the game. Slings it. They'll bring him down around the 46-yard line. That makes 
Third down, and they need to get it inside the 47. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. Scrambled. And he can't get the pass off, and he's sacked. And as the defense comes back out, you can be sure they're thinking about that score they surrendered the last time around. I think this defense has got to do something because right now the quarterback is in such a good rhythm that you've got to do something to try to get him out of it. I would suggest trying to bring more pressure. Try to come up with an exotic blitz look to try to get him on his heels as opposed to being the aggressor and attacking the defense. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. They go with a run. He takes it right side for a good game. Less than a minute to go. Here we go. Five, 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 five. Gains his way to the 19-yard line. From the 19-yard line, it's first down. Makes it to the 11. And this one comes to an end. Our final count in this game, 31-13, Miami. That brings this broadcast to a close. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreet, I'm Brad Nessler. We'll see you soon for another edition of NCAA Football 14.